I got some time to play a CDF, so let's do Angstrom CDF today. What are the challenges? Again, my teammates solved almost all of them. This one looks interesting. No sequels. The pre the prequels sucked and the sequels are much better, but at least we always have the original trilogy. Okay. And show him, yeah. Okay. So it's about MongoDB. To be honest, I never ever worked with MongoDB. I'm a SQL fan. <laughs> so let's see what is here. Not JS. Okay, so we have this endpoint slash login for post, and it requires username and password. They need to be filled. If not, this error will be provided. And it's doing a query. You about username and password. The equivalent of MySQL select select um, all from users where username equals user and password equal pass. Of course, user and pass are variables. And then it sets a cookie token with something <laughs> encoded probably. And I don't know Node.js as a language. And then it redirects to site. So probably site. Okay, got it. Let's start it. Firefox and burp. Come on. Temporary bird defaults. Proxy intercept is off. Who needs it? Yep. Uh, HTTP history. Okay. Clear history. Clear history, yes. Okay, test, test. Don't see. Where is it? Question browser sent to repeater. Okay. So, go. Wrong username and password. That will be something to guess it. <laughs> Just like that. Okay. Now. Mongo inject. CTF username. Let's see if we have something. Wait. Whoa. Huh. This one seems. Yeah, yeah. This one seems exactly the same, and this one. Okay, so let's see. Solution the username and password collected from the incoming data in the database is searched directly using this data. So, what if. We can pass objects as arrays. Uh, what's GT? Okay, so GT is an operator. Greater than, yeah, 
like the HTML and code value for greater than and probably lower than <laughs> low okay so quantity 20 greater than 0 and here greater than 1 okay let's see sorry I think I closed it. Ah. Yeah, but here it seems an array. Let's format it as a JSON. If it supports JSONs anyway. Password. Okay. It was GT. Well, I think we can leave it blank in this case. Let's see what happens. Greater than go. Hmm. Huh. Ah, okay. Uh, we need to modify the content type probably because it doesn't auto detect. It it seems. Okay, position 19. Arr! Position 42. Low. No way. We're not provided. Unexpected number. Yeah, of course. Password. <laughs> Password. Ah, sorry. Me and my sloppy fingers. Okay. Greater than one. Wasn't this the example? Ah, sorry. So it's a number. An operator based on IDs. Hmm. Operators start with where is it on my keyboard? Hmm. Wrong username or password. GT, GT, GT. Hmm, maybe it doesn't really work like this. Let's try it. One second. What are the operators? So EQ equals evaluation. 
expression. Oh, the Tom Tom Elegix, yeah. So basically, we are saying anything. Yes, it works. Okay, so we bypassed it. But if I remember right the code, we can't bypass it because the token won't be set. Uh, the token needs the username. Probably administrator. <laughs> okay, equals. If we are to play with operators. If we look at the code, the password yeah, is, uh, is not used at all. But let's, let's play a little. What's the password? Regex. Uh, has it? Is it in this chart set? Yay! I am binary search, you know. Manual binary search. Yay! Uh, Huh. Um, Low. You see? Haha. -ha. So we have the the first letter of the person <laughs> lol anyway doesn't matter so let's follow redirect bad why one second go hmm you remember they said the token in the code so maybe this is not sent follow redirection and go Okay. Yep. Ha! Ah, invalid signature. Probably because I used it multiple times. Let's try again. Where is it? Here. Go. Let's take it. Follow redirection. Put it. Go. No authorization token. Ah, I'm really, really, really today. Too tired. Sadly. La, 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 la. Way too tired. I really should go to sleep. Blah blah blah. Great. So that was all. I'll just go to sleep. Good night. <laughs>